yeah and you know what we can uh we can definitely dive into a few different things here um i'll go ahead and start off with something pretty controversial especially since it is men's mental health uh awareness month i believe i don't know what it's officially called but um yeah here here's my initial thoughts one of the things that i teach every single client i work with um is that men are not logical creatures and it might sound controversial because i believe that all people men women whatever the heck you want to call yourself everyone is an emotional creature and uh i'd say especially for guys that could be something that maybe they don't want to acknowledge but at the end of the day just because love is interpreted by men as respect does not mean that they don't want love. It just means that the lens that they view emotions through looks a little different from how women view emotions. But just because the lens is different doesn't mean that it's not emotional uh, in, in regards to the way that that men have needs and men communicate and men see things and feel things. Um, and the same way that, you know, whether you're a man or a woman, I mean, you're going to have emotional needs that got to get met. Um, and really it's those emotional needs that are driving every area of your life. And so when you go for a long time without your emotional needs getting met, what you end up doing is living this life where you're constantly chasing down, getting your needs met, whether it's through purpose or identity um, or just constantly needing everyone's respect, attention, validation. Um, and you know, the flip side is that you, you may be like, you, you don't want to acknowledge that you need any of those things at all. And so you end up on the other side of that pen 